Welcome to 3 Minute Thoughts. So, 25 years ago, so kind of recent, Lana Smorset came out with a song called Ironic. And shortly after that song came out, there was some people who said that all the examples in the song are not ironic. And then I've seen other people say that, no, no, they actually are ironic. There's even a comedian who comes out and says the irony of the song is there's no irony in the song. So here's the question. Is the song ironic, ironic? Before that, we need to answer what actually is irony. And this seems to be something that's been debated for, well, all of history. Yeah. Actually, let's start off definition or a definition since there are lots of different definitions. So the expression of one's meaning by using language that normally signifies the opposite typically for humorous or emphatic effect. Okay. The state of affairs or an event that seems deliberately contrary to what one expects and is often amusing as a result. And a literary technique originally used in Greek tragedy by which the full significance of the character's words or actions are clear to the audience or reader, although unknown to the character. Now, as so the second definition, where the events seem deliberately contrary to what one expects, I see a lot of the examples in the song take care, like the cover. You can then go through like all the various items and see similar types of situations where they are just weird coincidences. And I feel like weird coincidences fall into what's category as ironic. Think of it as the reverse. So people are saying that they're just coincidences, but think of it as the reverse. Now I don't have a good example of the reverse. But I will say people have debated this for a long time. I do see people debating like each item when they do say that these are ironic, are they situational ironic or dramatic ironic? And there's no consensus on that either. There's even when she says that life helps you out, that's verbal ironic, which is the third type of ironic, because life isn't helping you out, it's hurting you. Overall, I feel, yes, these examples are ironic. But the main takeaway is for the past 25 years, people have been shaming Alanis Morissette over the song. That was just something that she did for fun. And no one can have a consensus really of whether what is or isn't ironic about her song, but still, they're still shaming her. So why is it okay to shame women, at least to the extent that it seems to happen in this culture? I feel if a guy wrote this song, people wouldn't be as abusive in how they debate or or confront her about the song or confront this person about the song. That's a weird tangent, but I think that's a better discussion than whether or not the song is ironic is why people are being aggressive towards her because she has gotten a lot of shame and a lot of uh, uh, grief because of the song. Well, those are my thoughts. Hopefully that gets me coherent here. Let me know what you think on whether the song is ironic or not or other things. Have a good day.